Things that just hit differently for us ladies. When a girl compliments a girl, beautiful. When you hug us and you tell us we smell good. When you like another girl's fit, so you ask her, hey, where's that top from? And they actually tell you where it's from. And when you ask someone to take pictures for you and they be hyping you up behind the camera as they're, you know, it just hits so differently. Those pictures will come out perfect. Well, not really because we're gonna spend hours like looking through them and being like, okay, not this, this. But like, you know, behind the picture, you're like, you know that the person taking those pictures were hyping you up and it feels good. Best way to get candid pictures. about guys that may or may not be true so guys please let me know hi hello it's ann one you guys don't use conditioner when you wash your hair like it's just shampoo and that's it two you wash your face with your body soap three you choose anger over sadness so when you do get sad you just end up angry and bonus you start to distance yourself when you like somebody especially when you feel like you don't have a chance with this person guys let me know this is how you know she for sure likes you Hi, hello, it's Anne. Ladies, let me know, and let's go. One, it doesn't matter how busy or nervous she is, she will hang out with you. She'll find a way to hang out with you. Two, it's when she picks up on your hobbies and the things that you like too. Like, she'd probably never give these things a chance, but because you like them, she'll try. And three, please, ladies, let me know. But you know she really likes you when she starts to neglect herself. Horrible habit, I'm guilty. She will get so consumed in trying to talk to you, to hang out with you, that she kind of neglects everything else that she normally does for herself. Things like, I don't know, sleep. We gotta stop doing that though. Ladies, let me know. This is how you know she's not playing you. Hi, hello, it's Anne. Let's go. One, her family knows about you. Two, when you guys are hanging out and she bumps into someone she knows, she will introduce you. And three, this one's really important. If her best friend knows about you, but not only knows about you, but likes you, once bestie knows, bestie knows, and that just confirms it all. This girl likes you. I don't know who needs to hear this, but I'm going to say it anyways, but breakups are not easy. Whether it be friendship breakups or romantic breakups. And as time goes on, you're going to get used to not talking to them every day, which is probably one of the most difficult parts of the breakup. It's letting them go and going about your days without them. But although not talking to them does get easier, there is going to be a day where you're not feeling so great and it has nothing to do with them. You're struggling with something else. Something else is stressing you out. And then you're going to realize that the one person that knew how to help you cope knew how to talk you through things, knew how to make you feel better is no longer gonna be that person because it's no longer their job. So now you're in another phase of the breakup where you have to learn how to cope and deal with things on your own and not have their support. And it's not easy because then you start spiraling again knowing that they're not there to help you. But I'm here to remind you that although it hurts, you are going to learn how to cope without them. It's time to be there for yourself. You got this. If he does this, it's because he likes you. Hi, hello, it's Anne. Guys, let me know and let's go. One, it's when he's consistent and he replies back to your messages pretty quickly. Especially when he keeps asking you what you're doing almost every hour because he just doesn't know how to continue the conversation, but he doesn't want to stop talking to you. Two, whenever he sees you, he will not ignore you. He will always greet you. But not only that, he will take his time saying bye to you because he just doesn't want to leave. It's never just a high and bye situation. And three, he will make jokes and he will tease you, but the moment someone else does, he gets really protective and he's like, no, that's not okay. Guys, let me know. Things she will do because she's nervous and she likes you. Hi, hello, it's Anne. Ladies, let me know and let's go. One, she's going to fidget, whether it be with her hair, her phone, whatever. Two, she will not be able to look you in your eyes. And if she does, she's going to look away smiling because she's going to start blushing. Three, she's going to be so quiet, especially when she's normally kind of talkative. And bonus ladies, please let me know because we can agree to disagree, but you guys will barely eat your food when you're around them. Like you'll eat, but it's not the way you normally eat. Guys, let me know if I'm wrong. No context, just watch the video and let me know. Hi, hello, it's Anne. One, you say you're over them, but you're really not. It actually takes you a long time to get over someone. Two, you know you're really mad when you just have nothing to say, you're just silent. Because if you start saying something while you're mad, you're just going to be hurting everybody's feelings. And three, you think crying is a sign of weakness. So you tend to act like you just don't care. 
when in reality it's really bothering you and hurting you. You know she's comfortable with you and she does not care what she looks like. She could wear makeup, no makeup, dressed up, dressed down. She can eat her food in front of you. When she could take pictures and videos of herself around you. When she can cry in front of you and actually allows you to comfort her. And when you witness her being hangry. Because normally she's going to try and cover it up like, oh no, I'm not hungry. No, you will know she's hungry. Ladies, let me know. You know he's comfortable with you when he's upset and he actually wants to rant to you about it. It's when he has absolutely no filter. When he hangs out with you, he will act like a damn child. And he is for sure comfortable with you when he doesn't feel like he needs to look good all the time. Like he won't even fix his hair. Guys, let me know.